Hey Boca Fam, it's Cypher Noir. Uh, I'm here today to talk about Amigurumi, Amigurumi? I guess it depends on how you pronounce it. Pronounce it. Amigurumi. Uh, it is the fun art of crocheting dolls. Um, it's pretty common. Uh, I believe that Amigurumi was a uh, doll practice in Japan. I mean, it sounds Japanese. I could be very wrong. I did not research this before. <laughs> I probably should have, but I did not. Um, so anyway, I recently got into it. Um, I decided for Christmas that I would make uh, dolls for my friends, and uh, I sneakily asked them uh, who their favorite um, who their favorite evolution was, and so I found some really cool free patterns. Um, I'm gonna review those as well as like, talk about them. So it is 53 stitches, the number 5, the number 3, and then stitches all together. I will put that link in the description. Uh, they have a few free patterns, and they're super easy to follow. They're super easy to read if you know how to uh, crochet, even just basically. Um, they have a, I believe they have a frequently, a frequently heard of, of facts, um, so that you're able to figure out how to read a crochet pattern if you don't already know. Um, and, uh, so I made my friends Sylveon, Flareon, Glaceon, Espeon, Leafeon, and I need to make myself another Jolteon, um, but I decided to round out the, the group so that I would be able to say I made all of them. Um, so I actually also made them to do a coffee raffle because I, I just really enjoy crocheting and really enjoy being able to sit and watch TV while I, or binge a show or whatever while I am crocheting. So I did that while I was, <laughs> I, I, went, I got through King of the Hill um, again, um, just watching that and um, crocheting the clothes. It's just really relaxing for me and uh, while I don't want to make it a full time job, uh, just because I, just don't, I don't have time to add on another uh, aspect of my shop. Uh, I do want to offer folks the opportunity to get something if they can, if they either don't know how to crochet or don't want to learn how to crochet. Or just, some people it just doesn't click and for the longest time I thought, sorry, I thought that that was me and then I went back recently and I just, I was patient and that, that's mostly what the issue was is that I, I wasn't patient enough to read the patterns and sit down um, so for the longest time I only knew how to single crochet and double crochet um, anyways so the four dolls that I do have on hand that I was coffee ra or was raffling off on my coffee um, I have Evie he's not shiny it just looks shiny in the photos um, we have Jilteon but I love his little spikes. They took so long for me to make. We have Vaporeon. His little mermaid tail. And we have Umbreon. Um, you can see the stuffing a little bit because remember I am uh, still beginning learning these guys. Um, and the details are made with felt that I hot glued on because I was not patient enough to, uh, <laughs> I was not patient enough to hand sew it on, um, especially because, uh, like I said, I'm still learning, and, um, so yeah, like, honestly, this, these patterns were super easy to read for me, uh, having basic, basic crochet knowledge, uh, it took me about six hours per crochet doll and um, I think total supplies it cost me about six or seven dollars uh, which I will link the yarns in the description you can find those on Amazon um, and the safety eyes will also be uh, put in the description you guys can find those and um, yeah definitely like it's, it's actually honestly really fun I'll also uh, link really awesome crochet kit that I got. Uh, it comes with, I think like 13, 
I think it's 13 different crochet hooks as well as um, metal needles. So when you're sewing together, you use the needles um, to attach the limbs. Um, it has uh, stitch markers and not just one, it has like 10 of them, I think. And um, it has, excuse me. <laughs> It has a little pair of uh, scissors so that it's just like an all-around perfect kit. Um, I believe it was like $14 and I got it off of Amazon and I was just like... And it, it was really great. Um, for Evie, so for their patterns, for they have Evie and Flareon have brushed out fur. So like, and it's not even fur, it's yarn. Brushed out yarn, it's acrylic um, and you have to have an acrylic or um, acrylic or a um, yarn that works well with being frayed. So I made the bodies out of cotton and then I used uh, acrylic for the fluff and then took a metal pet brush, which is also really inexpensive. I will link that. Um, so everything, everything, oh, I'll link it. Um, Cause this quarantine I have been just crazy on Amazon and just going to buy a wallet. <laughs> so um, you'll take a pet brush and you brush it out and it takes a hot minute. Like, it like I think it took me like 10 or 15 minutes to brush it out um, perfectly. Uh, but luckily there are YouTube tutorials for just about anything. Um, so if you get the chance, you can also buy their pattern or buy 53 stitches patterns if you would like to support them. I just wanted something a little cheaper that I was able to make for my friends because my favorite my favorite type of gift to give is a handmade gift that I have made. Um, so for Christmas, I made them um, these amigurumis and bought them uh, pins because we all cosplay the Sailor Senshi and I got them matching uh, transformation ones. And I also made them Disney princess ornaments. I'm not gonna talk about them because this is a Pokemon channel. <laughs> Get out of here, nerd. So, <laughs> so um, definitely if you got a, a chance, you can check out the description if you'd like to give it a try. It's honestly really easy. Um, like after a little bit of practicing, um, you can give that a try. Again, there's YouTube tutorials on how to crochet. Uh, if you can, please comment below and tell me what Pokemon craft you would like me to talk about, what you would like me to um, review, explain, or you can tell me what Amigurumi you would like me to make. Um, if I choose your, if I choose your um, Pokemon, will make you a amigurumi as long as it's like reasonable um so something small like this i can absolutely do and ship to you guys um but larger projects like a lowland marrow or a lowland executor um may be a little more difficult to make and ship but uh definitely be on the lookout in my coffee which i will uh link that just be on the lookout for that because maybe I'll have <laughs> a uh, raffle for the Lowland Executor and Executor because I uh, am obsessed with Pokemon and if you're like 